Hello, my name is Emily, as you may or may not know, um, and wow, I said that with a different uh, cadence and inflection that time. Uh, but today we are going to be watching, or rather listening to, yet again, <laughs> Boyfriend ASMR. Woo! You know, I listened to Boyfriend ASMR a while ago, and then I listened to Girlfriend ASMR, and now we're, uh, we're bringing it back to the boys, all right? Bringing it back to the boys. That's something we should, you know, I think the boys need more, right? We should, that's something we should get on. Giving men more things. But yes, anyways, I'm going to listen to Boyfriend ASMR on my iPad, because my phone, unfortunately, is running out of storage. It's packed to the brim. With what, you may ask? Photos of myself. Oh my god, I feel like a middle-aged woman who just got divorced and now I'm on my iPad looking up, you know, boyfriend ASMR to like make me feel loved again. Some of these seem a little not safe for work. Let's see, getting into an argument with your protective boyfriend. Ringing, I'm calling, I'm calling, or you're calling, somebody's calling. Hi, right, my girl, what's up? What are you, what are you talking about? I, I'm sorry, I, I just, I, I didn't know... Hold on, hold on. What? You're saying too much at one time, I can't hear you. I hardly even said anything. Where are you? The club. Where are you? You're where? The club! The club. Why are you there for? To have fun! It's a girls' night. I'm confused, because you told me you were gonna be home studying, so... I got bored. Why are you out at a club for? Um, because I got bored and oh, give me a break. I don't believe that for a second. You don't believe that I got bored studying? It's quite common experience. Yeah. Well, we're gonna talk about it more when I get there. Don't come. It's a girls' night. We are. I wanna know what's actually going on. Oh no, here he comes. I hear the Toyota Camry pulling up. First of all, let's start off with who you were here with. My friends, my girlfriends. Because if it's who I think it is, we've already talked about that before. I'm not allowed to hang out with my female friends. Ever heard of female friendship? Did you see the Barbie movie, perhaps? How many times is this going to happen before you realize that it's it's going to keep happening? I don't like, know. What what happened? You said that you were going to drop her. Why, why are you still hanging out with She's her She's rich. She has a pool. <laughs> Reason enough. She's she's a lame. She is. All she wants to do is go out every night and get fucked up and drink. And it's ridiculous. She has a trust fund. She doesn't really have anything else to do. I feel like you treat me like I'm your dad or something sometimes. Like, you don't have to hide things from me when you go out or lie to me. I didn't lie. Like, you're an adult. You can do whatever you want. But we're in a relationship, and- I was screaming at the dramatic music playing in the background as as if that's what's supposed to be playing at the club. It's literally the- And then I give it an and Give it an and The one time I was at the club and they started playing Hello by Adele. And yeah, I was literally like, hello? And if you would have just talked to me about this, we could have prevented this whole thing. I didn't want you to come. I could have gotten an Uber. No. You know what, dude? I, I appreciate your candor and your concern, but I don't need a protective boyfriend, okay? Because I'm already protected by NordVPN. Didn't you know that already? Riddle me this. Would you guys like to become safer online with just one click? I think you do. <laughs> and if you go to nordvpn.com slash not even Emily, it's like getting, you know, little metal bars on your windows. Right? A little protection. As amazing as technology is, there are still bad things like phishing, password attacks, ransomware, mal-advertising. With the help of NordVPN, they can help you avoid all of these dangers. NordVPN has threat protection which can shield you from malware, trackers, and ads. They don't track or share what you do online, and all of your traffic is protected with encryption. And not only does NordVPN protect you online and grant you privacy, but it also allows you to watch content from around the globe, or if you're traveling, it can allow you to connect back home. Home. Every purchase of the two-year plan will receive an additional four bonus months on top. This includes all plans. 
okay? The works. Standard, plus, and complete. So if you want to protect yourself online and be able to watch content from all around the world, make sure to get an exclusive NordVPN deal at nordvpn.com slash notevenemily. Try it risk-free now with a 30-day money-back guarantee. Again, for all of these awesome features, make sure to go to nordvpn.com slash notevenemily. And thank you, NordVPN, for sponsoring today's video. Okay, now, uh, back to my my lovely boyfriends that I love so much. I I need him, I love him, I want him. What, what can I really say? That was a fib. Your chaotic boyfriend hates scary movies, so you make him watch one. And then in the thumbnail it says, pizza guy boyfriend. Me ordering a pizza and I just kidnap the Domino's guy and I'm like, listen buddy, we're watching Human Centipede whether you want to or not. Okay, so here's the thing. <laughs> I get it. The whole alien head thing blowing up was nasty, but I'm still not really get Was nasty. Especially. Especially. Especially since you seemed sickly excited. Sickly excited. He said, you ma'am were frothing at the mouth, convulsing on the floor, seizing at the thought of, of watching this movie. Can a girl express some emotion? Because you think this movie's gonna scare the shit out of me. And you find that funny. I am screaming. You think this movie is gonna scare the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Is something funny? <laughs> hey, hey, honey, hey, hey, honey, 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 baby, darling, honey. Oh my God, what is going on? Being in the movie theater with this guy, and you just hear besides you, hey, honey, 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 sweetie, babykins, honey, pop, honey, pop. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Are you, do, are you looking at me though? No, I'm looking at the movie! I'm trying to watch the movie! All right, all right, let's see. What are we working with here? Possessive boyfriend gets jealous and calls you a brat. Boyfriend screams at you and accidentally makes you cry. And the thumbnail, the thumbnail says, just shut up, please. Your laugh is so annoying. Oh, Jesus Christ, just stop smiling. It's such a ghastly sight. <laughs> I don't think it's that funny. I don't think it's that funny. Why are you laughing so loud? Oh, shut the fuck up. It's not that funny. I promise. Yeah. Oh. What did you just say to me? I think I'm gonna need to hear that again because you did not just say that to me. I don't think it's me. that funny. I don't think it's that funny. Why are you laughing so loud? Oh, shut the fuck up. It's not that funny. I promise you, it's not that funny. <laughs> like it's not that funny. Like shit, you're so fucking annoying. Your laugh's so fucking annoying. I, uh, oh my god, I forgot to breathe. Babe, can you keep your joy to yourself? It's fucking pissing me off. Ew, stop trying to kiss me. Every time you kiss me, I have to rub the skin off with sandpaper because you're so fucking gross. Like, damn, all you wanna do is scroll on Insta Reels? Is it that funny? <laughs> Like, Jesus, you want to laugh? Ha, 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 I'm going to put on an hour-long Netflix comedy special, okay? And I'm going to make sure it's top tier. Five stars, baby. I am going to be cracking up. Ha, 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 he ho, ha, 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 with the bullhorn right in your face. I can hear you from all the way across the street. Like, you're laughing so obnoxiously. Like, Jesus fucking Christ, it's not that fucking funny. I promise you, it's not that funny. Whatever you're watching is not that funny. How many times are you gonna- I swear, it's really not- How many times are you gonna say the same thing over and over again? Oh my god, I feel like you're a parrot squawking in my ear. It's not that funny! It's not that funny! It's not that funny! Why are you scrolling on Insta Reels? It's not that funny. I promise okay, you. Okay, I'm just gonna keep skipping ahead and I swear to god, if you're- if you- Is it just gonna be eight minutes full of it's not that funny? Stop scrolling through Insta Reels. Whatever video that you watched that made you laugh like that, it's not funny at all. It's not funny, and it never will be funny. You're since Mind you, I just skipped ahead two minutes, and this guy is still basically saying the same thing over and over again. 
It's not funny. Why are you? This video is not even funny. Can you shut up? You're not, you're not a funny individual person. Tell me one joke. Knock, Tell me one knock. joke right now. Um, who's Go there? Ahead. Um, why did the chicken cross the road? Um, maybe I'm not funny. I'm sorry. Oh, shit, if you got a laugh and you got something that you think is funny, keep it in. Hold it inside. Oh! No one's trying to, no one's trying to fucking hear your dumbass laugh. Like, fuck, man. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, that laugh actually was a little obnoxious. But I just can't imagine. Imagine you're laying down in bed after a long day at work with your boyfriend. You see a video and it, it just tickles your fancy a little bit and you let out a little giggle. And then he goes, kill yourself. Shy boyfriend explains the FNAF lore, in parentheses rambling, and it's 42 minutes long. ASMR Yandere stalker breaks in. Animated boyfriend roleplay. Okay, and then the thumbnail says, I love watching you sleep. You know, honestly, with him saying, what is it? I love, I love watching you sleep. At least it's a compliment. You know, after that, that latest one, where all I did was breathe and he was like, you know what, I'm gonna slam a concrete slab right up into your mouth so you shut up. You know, I feel like this one, although it definitely will be unhealthy and not good, I might appreciate it a little. It's like, you know, at least you're throwing me a bone here. <sighs> Finally. Hello, love. You look beautiful, night. I know you're asleep right now, but... Oh. I just couldn't stay away. And I hope I'm not visiting at a bad time. What is 3 a.m.? <laughs> Who am I kidding? It's never a bad time to visit you. Oh. <laughs> Especially tonight when you look so angelic. I'm sure you wouldn't mind if I got a closer look at you, right? I'm unconscious. What can I do about it, I guess? <coughs> your hair looks so... <laughs> Thank you. Well, I'm sure you're fine with me petting your head just a little bit. I don't want to wake you up, but... Oh, how considerate. <laughs> well, considering I'm going to be your future boyfriend, I'm sure you wouldn't mind that anyways. And I'm sure you'd be fine with... Your boyfriend taking a look around in your room again, Ew, right? oh my god, he's traveling. <laughs> oh so, my god, this is like the sisterhood of the traveling ASMR Yandere stalker breaks into your boyfriend. Like or he doesn't- he is my boyfriend. He's not breaking into my boyfriend. Um... <laughs> I can't believe you got your room this messy again. Excuse you. It is messy. Now your clothes are everywhere. How did you know? I am scared. I am scared. Where are you? I can tell you're just putting off doing your laundry. The amper is filled with clothes, and it's spilling all over the floor, too. Okay, call me out, why don't you? You know. He's like walking around my apartment like, you're such an angelic angel, but these roaches in the corner, though. Once we're together, I'll be sure to do all your laundry. Oh, thank you, babe. ASMR boyfriend snaps over burnt dinner. You almost burnt the whole freaking house down, you idiot. Oh my god, we're just really getting into what it. What the hell would you have done if I hadn't walked in at the right time? Burnt down, I guess. Yeah, you probably would have freaking panicked like a little girl, obviously. You seriously couldn't make dinner without turning the whole thing into a freaking disaster, huh? Popcorn is hard to make. I'm sorry. Do you even know how to use a fire extinguisher? No. <laughs> I feel like you're too stupid, honestly. But yeah, yeah. You'd probably point the thing backwards and shoot yourself in the face. <laughs> freaking bimbo. I bet you don't even know how to use the fire extinguisher. I bet you put the nozzle up your ass and use it like an enema. Why do you always make mistakes? Why can't you just grow the hell up so I can actually learn to trust you? I'm sorry. You act like you're better than this, but obviously you're not. Do I have to take your oven mitts away from you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Don't make me confiscate the oven mitts. Don't make me take away your spatula and put it in the timeout corner, along with the tongs. Okay, but obviously you haven't matured much. What were you even doing while you were burning my freaking dinner? Playing Roblox or some crap? <laughs> sorry. I've wanted this lasagna. All. Day. Long. I've been longing for it. <laughs> I've been- I've been yearning and having this deep, deep desire for this lasagna. Oh my god, look at this thing. It's burnt to a freaking crisp. Well, it was on fire. Can you believe this? Yeah? What the hell do you expect me to eat now? I don't care if you made me dinner a f freaking hundred times in the past, okay? It's like, because this time, no, no, this time was different. This time was supposed to be different. This time you were supposed to make it properly and- 
Is it our fucking anniversary or something? What is he talking about? At first I was like, okay, I was being irresponsible. So like, I get that you're mad or whatever. But it's like, you know, I know that you've cooked me a hundred perfect five course meal dinners in the past, but this one lasagna, you burnt, so have fun in hell. It's different because I have to work extra shifts now because of you. Me? What? Because you can't get a job. Oh. And I gotta pay for everything. Hey. Don't say that. <laughs> Don't even have any real hobbies for Christ's sake. Yeah. Yeah, 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 you kind of like art. I don't give a rat's ass. Okay, is your art helping to pay the bills, huh? No. Then why should I give it then? Ooh. Why can't you get a freaking job and then learn how to keep it? Ah. What's your excuse for failing everything? Um. Like, everyone's got to grow up and grow up at some point, right? I'm only 37. Cool. You just need to get some help. I'm 37 like, years young. You really are, you're pathetic. Whoa. You really are just pathetic. What do you plan on doing now, huh? Uh, well, I guess I gotta make a new lasagna. <laughs> Shy boyfriend crying when he feels insecure. Reverse comfort. No, I can't look like this. No, I can't. No, no, please, God, please, why? why? Oh my God, these ones, it's like we're really getting into it. I feel like a lot of the ones, like, you know, there's a little bit of build up. They come home, hey, babe, how was your day? You know, this or that. And this one is just, oh, I'm really good. <laughs> okay, but we love. Continue. No, why is this happening now? <laughs> What? I don't want to look like this. No, what the heck's going on? It's one pimple. Why do I? No. You're oh fine. My God. People get at, uh, at oh pimples sometimes. This is so bad. This is so bad. No. I mean, we're just not going now, to. No, no, no. We're just no, going no, to Trader no, Joe's. No, it's no, not that no, serious. No. I wanted it to be a good day today. It will be. But I can't have that happen, can I? Oh my God, what am I going to do? Pimple patch. Pimple patch. What am I going to do? Pimple <laughs> patch. Pimples. They're there. <laughs> Maybe I could wear a mask or something. Yeah, wear a mask. No, but it's not Halloween today. I don't, I don't have an excuse. Just wear it. <laughs> Did he was he was he talking about like a, putting on a whole ghost face mask or something like that or a, a furry suit? Just put on a remember COVID that little thing that happened? Yeah, put on that type of mask. Oh my god, it hurts too much. It hurt. Oh. Hold on. It's okay. Let me at least. Try to look at myself in the mirror for one second. Right. No, 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 oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I hate it. So hold much. in your vomit, hold in your vomit. Yeah. Why do I have to look like this? You have a hot girlfriend now, so <laughs> that's good, right? Cheer up, head up, king. I just feel like it keeps getting worse. No. You know what, I know what I'm gonna get you for your birthday. Cosmetic surgery. I remember that one time when that one woman just completely refused to look at me, even though I just asked her for the time. <laughs> what? Are you, what? Am I dating like the hunchback of Notre Dame or something? How, uh, how ugly could you possibly be? Maybe she was just distracted. I think that you're making thing, me gaslighting him. Yeah, that didn't happen. It must have been because I was so ugly. I don't, I think you're jumping to conclusions <laughs> here, babe. No wonder I've been alone for so long. Hello? I'm right here! Because ugly people always end up alone, don't they? Just like my mom always said. <laughs> you know, it's just like my mom always said. Ugly people don't deserve rights. My mom taught me a very valuable lesson when I was young. That I'm ugly and worthless. The way everyone treats you is directly related to what you look like. He's not... You're not oh, wrong, I, I guess. Hate how true that is. Ugh, ugh. I was supposed to meet with that cute girl today, but... What am I gonna do? I won't be able to- I'm sorry, am I your girlfriend or not? Because you're talking about, oh, I'm so alone and no one loves me. I was supposed to meet with a cute girl today, but I'm so ghastly that she probably won't even come within a yard of me. And it's like, ASMR shy boyfriend crying when he feels insecure. This is not my boyfriend. Perhaps we're Polly. ASMR overly clingy and needy boyfriend gets angry. Intense. <laughs> <laughs> Turn around. Whoa! And where do you think you're going? Huh? To the grocery store. And why does it look like you're trying to hide something from me? I'm just... Wait. I need shrimp. Why don't I just ask you a few questions? Okay, right? Mr. FBI, sir. Come on. 
I deserve to know something. Just ask already. Where were you yesterday night? My other boyfriend's house. Usually, you come home around maybe around 9.24 p.m. 9.20? A little bit earlier, a little bit later, give or take. But you came home way later than that. Yes. And now, you did it again. Yes, because I was engaging in coitus with my- trying to sneak into the bedroom without me noticing. Other boyfriend. Coitus with my other boyfriend. You have a very interesting life. It's quite admirable. A little bit concerning, is all, but if I remember correctly... Are you, you out of, like, like, are me. you out of breath or something? Did you just run a mile or do the pacer test? Because it's like, I heard that you went, you to, went the to the store, store without, without me. me. So why don't you be a good baby and hang out with me more? Oh! Possessive boyfriend stands up for you. I think the wifey's home. The old ball and chain. Hey there, Starlight. Hi! How was your day? Bad. It was bad. Yeah. Whoa there, tiger. Was it that bad? Yeah. Awful. Awful. You don't want to talk about it. I could. You don't have to think about anything. You don't have to do anything. Head empty, no thoughts. Love it. How about you just sit there all cute like you usually do? How does that sound? <clears throat> Wonderful. I can do that. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> And listen, there's probably nothing in the world that could ever be more important than you. I don't want you to ever forget that. Not even world peace? My lovely princess. Ew. So, Tiger, tell me. Why do he... It seems like you had a rough he day. He keeps calling me Tiger. Like, I feel like I'm like his son or something, you know? Like, go, uh... Now, now, Tyler, you listen to me. You're gonna go left field and you're gonna kick some butt today, Tiger. What exactly happened today? My coworker slashed my tires because I called her husband an ogre. Yeah, I promise I won't touch you. Huh? Yeah, that project that you were running. Yeah. <laughs> Is it that same asshole manager? Yes. John. John. Oh, fuck no. What did he say this time? Uh, that I was worthless to the company and could never do any good. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, the nerve. Right, the nerve. It's like, I don't hand in a few dozen projects and I, you know, call my co-worker's husband an ogre and, you know, you know, miss the toilet a few times when I'm shitting in the company bathroom and it's like, oh, all of a sudden I'm not an asset to the company anymore. This guy sounds ungrateful. Very much so. Very I much. I don't like that. I don't like it either. I told you the last time, if something like this happened, just call me. Yeah, well, sometimes violence is an answer. Oh! All right. I, uh... Let's wrap it up. Let's wrap it up. Um, I hope you all enjoyed indulging in some boyfriend ASMR with me. Uh, you know, a very lovely venture. Hello. This is me, editing. Um, and I just want to say that... Will... Why... Will... Editing... This video really seems to be a, tw a 23 minute long venture of me hating. <laughs> but I just wanna say, and I, I probably don't even have to preface this, but I wanna say that every bitchy thing I say or do is a joke. And I actually love my boyfriend ASM artists because I wouldn't be able to make vid these videos without them. So thank you for your service. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed today's video and until next time.